finally I can talk to the camera. <laughs> it was so loud in the restaurant. But I'm with Joel, we just had breakfast. Um, <laughs> I'm French now. <laughs> he also went to Paris last week. Yes. Last week, yeah. But we weren't there at the same time. Nope. Um, and then I have a lunch event in a little bit, which should be really fun. And then I'm seeing my friend Vanessa for coffee later. So I will take you guys along with me. with your stirring make sure you just persevere through to the next stage otherwise you'll just have the praline <laughs> Hi guys, <laughs> I am back in the car because I am back on my way home. Um, Ollie's just picking up our tiles for the corridor at the moment. So he would be here, but he's just gone in and doing that. But yeah, I ended up not being able to stay for the cooking class, um, which I was a little bit gutted about because it looked really, really cool. But hopefully I can actually go back and go and actually take like um, a proper cooking class there because it looked really really fun um, and then yeah I went to go and had a catch up with my friend Vanessa who I have not seen I think since I've either gotten married or engaged I can't remember <laughs> it's been that long so to be honest like we were just catching up um, and I didn't really record much apart from like the beginning bit that I did record but yeah I will also oh, there is. I will also show you guys what I got in my goodie bag when I get home what are they doing they're getting the tiles yeah from the tile I got reversed to the back of the warehouse and they'll load them in for me oh, special customer service for a special customer
finally we got them. It's <laughs> three months of waiting for these. Three months of waiting for tiles. Right, we're now gonna go to Costco. Oh, God, the car's really heavy now. Super, yeah. um, gonna go to Costco now and grab some dinner because we're really near. I actually have my Costco card today for a change. The picture on the back is actually quite funny. There's just so much like random crap here. Right. <laughs> it's so random. I do love a Costco trip though. Not quite in Costco. I don't think I've ever seen Costco this empty before. Mm. I guess we don't really come in the evening. What do we want for dinner? <laughs> you got why you got loads of oh fruit and chicken wings. Uh, maybe tacos? Good morning guys! Um, uh, I know I sound really chirpy, but I am not. I am so tired. Um, I went out last night, which is not something that I would usually do, kind of like last minute or just ever. I'm a homebody and I like to be in bed early but it was one of Ollie's friends birthday yesterday and they planned like a little surprise birthday drinks for him and yeah I went out <laughs> I got the call at like I think it was like 5 45 I had just showered thank god and um Ollie was like do you want to come out for drinks with all of us and I was like yeah, that sounds really fun. Um, I was so bored. I remember it's raining, but it's like dead sunny. <laughs> um, so yeah, I had like 15, 20 minutes to get ready. And then I headed out. It was really fun. It was really nice. I got to meet, well, I got to see Ollie's friend that I haven't seen in a very long time. I met his girlfriend who was really lovely and um, I can highly recommend if you go to be at one order the honey Cosmo that drink is so so nice I had a few of those yesterday so yeah I think that's what make, is making me really slow and tired this morning today Saturday it is a also like a last minute plan kind of thing so my best friend um is getting married in a few months and she is doing like a little bridal shower thing with her fiance's like family like the woman in that family um and i think one of the girls couldn't make it so she asked me last night if i wanted to come and i think it's like um an afternoon tea situation at this place called Victor's in Oxford which I've been meaning to go and check it out um, so this has worked out really well because now I get to go and yeah have afternoon tea I think she wants to have a few drinks as well so that's gonna be fun that's why I was like I didn't go too crazy last night because I knew that I was probably gonna have a drink or two today yeah this is gonna be fun today um, so because we were drinking last night, Ollie left his car in Reading um, and he's gone to go and get it now and then hopefully he'll be back really soon because I just want to go and grab some breakfast. Um, I don't want to cook this morning, I don't have the energy to cook. So I think we're just going to go down to the Copper Club and grab some breakfast. So yeah, that is our plan today. I am just going to chuck on a track suit I'm just like I'm not hungover or anything but I just feel like really sluggish and really slow um so yeah I just need like a big fry up I think <laughs> a big fry up usually fixes everything yeah I just want some bacon <laughs> some sausages uh beans tomatoes hash brown i don't know 
kind of anything at this point. I'm so hungry. Before I forget, I will show you guys what I got in the molten brown gift bag. I totally forgot to do it the other day. We came home, I was absolutely exhausted. So I just ate the tacos and then watched The Bachelor. I just went to sleep. Like I was so, so tired. Um, so we have the new fragrance, which is the Rhubarb and Rose. And they customize my bottle for me, which is so, so pretty. But they've painted a rose and rhubarb on there. It's so pretty, I love it. And it smells amazing. And then we have like the, is this the hand soap? Yes, the hand wash refill. I'm really annoyed because I actually left the glass bottle that they personalized for me as well. I left it at the event um, by accident, which is really annoying. Um, but I do have a spare like amber glass jar that I use for hand wash downstairs. So this is perfect. But I just really like the fact that you can buy the refillable pouches for the hand wash. And then we also have um, a little gift set in this really beautiful packaging which i think is absolutely perfect for mother's day um so i think i'm actually give this to my mum for mother's day but it has an eau toilette a bath and shower gel and a body lotion of course in the rose and rhubarb fragrance it's so nice i think that's it oh and there's also like a is it a recipe card yes the recipe card on how to make the dessert that I was going to make the other day, but I didn't have um, the time. So I'm really, really happy that they actually gave me a recipe card so I can make it at home. I'm so happy right now. Oh. So I thought I'd show you guys my outfit for the afternoon tea. I wouldn't actually wear my glasses, but I ran out of contact lenses. So I have no choice but to wear my glasses because I'm so blind. But um, yeah, I'm wearing like a green sweatshirt from Pull and Bear. Absolutely love it. The color is so, so nice. Um, the necklace is from, uh, where is it from? It's from Etsy, like a little store on there. Um, my bag is from Public Desire. Jeans are redone. And then little boots from Bellini, the ones that I showed you guys before. They are so cute. I wore them around London the other day. And yeah, I think that is my outfit. Oh, 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 oh,